the Universal Combined Arrestor Blitz Ductor Connect protects measuring and control circuits as well as bus and telecommunication systems from damage caused by lightning and surges. Please observe the enclosed installation instructions and notes. Snap the arrestor into the DIN rail. The practical thing here is that the device is automatically earthed by contacting the DIN rail and you don't need to connect a separate earth wire. The devices can be labelled to clearly identify the arrestors in the circuit diagram. Now connect the arrestors. Start with the incoming lines on the unprotected side of the blitz duct to connect. Use the push-in terminals to directly connect the rigid lines to the arrestor. Simple, quick and tool-free. Now close the cable duct with a suitable cover. The next step is to connect the lines from the system on the protected side of the blitz duct to connect. When connecting the flexible lines, use a slotted screwdriver to press in the grey button on the arrestor. The line is connected directly to the arrestor here too. Then close the cable duct on this side as well. The blue arrestor series protects intrinsically safe measuring circuits and bus systems. These arrestors are connected using flexible lines. Remember that the lines of intrinsically safe measuring circuits must be connected using wire end ferrules on both sides. The push-in buttons also make it easier to install the blue arrestors. Now install the two-part DIN Record Remote Signaling Unit. This will permanently monitor the arrestor groups. Connect the 24 volt power supply and the brake contact for the remote signaling function. The reverse unit is simply clipped into the DIN rail. Install the XI partition to maintain a distance of 50 mm between the intrinsically safe and the non-intrinsically safe signal circuit. Switch on the power supply to activate the remote signaling unit. The LED on the unit lights up red. After a few seconds, it changes to green. Now your system is safe and protected.